Grand Rising, everybody. This is a uh, Goddess Kendra. So I want to discuss Jordan Woods, Tristan Thompson, the Jenner and Kardashian clan. Now sources say that at a mansion party, Tristan Thompson and Jordan Woods are spot kissing. Now, how in the world? Could you, Jordan, be kissing your best friend's sister's baby daddy? Like, nobody was going to see you. Like, I don't understand. This is why I have trust issues with friendships because motherfuckers get jealous of you and will plot on your ass. Now, do I feel sorry for... Now, do I feel sorry for Khloe Kardashian? Hell no, because it's funny, when she got with Tristan, his fiance Jordan, Craig was pregnant, and she didn't give a fuck. This man clearly does not love you, Chloe, because he continues to cheat on you. He cheated on you when you were fucking pregnant. Now, what Jordan did was extremely wrong, and that's not cool at all. I don't know if she was doing it awesome. I want some attention. Let's see if my career could take off further. Or was it pure revenge? I don't know. But that's not okay. You don't do that. Tristan is a whole ass nigga. And no matter who he's with, he's going to continue to cheat. <clears throat> Excuse me. He's going to continue to cheat. He's going to continue to cheat. And it is stated that um, at first, Chloe didn't believe that this was true because we all know if you go to the Kardashian home, you're not allowed to film or take pictures. It's in their contract. It's like, what are you trying to hide? Anyways, she didn't believe it. And they say... What goes around comes around, so I find it hilarious because you thought this man was going to be faithful to you. Was he doing this because he doesn't want to be with you, or are y'all staging this shit for uh, season 16 of Keeping Up with the Kardashians? I don't fucking know. They do anything for a storyline, and they're attention-seeking. I mean, jeez. I guess they say all press is good press, whether good or bad. But it is said that uh, Kylie has kicked her best friend Jordan Woods out of the mansion. And that uh, Jordan had released a statement. Girl, you won't have to say anything. Like, I kind of knew her and Kylie wouldn't be friends. Like, have a long-lasting friendship. But I didn't think she would do something like that. That is just fucking mean as hell. Like, I've had to tell my homegirls, we went to the party and your man tried to kiss me. I don't know if you mad at me or not, but I'm coming to you as a woman and don't touch me. And I slapped the shit out of his motherfucking ass because I refuse to sleep with someone's boyfriend, spouse, fiance, husband. That's some hoe ass shit. Now this young woman, Jordan, thought that because the Kardashians do these type of things, because let's talk about Chloe's track record. She basically um, was with um, Tristan when he was with Jordan Mack, and then she had been in relationships with Trina the Rapper's boyfriend, French Montana, and a um, basketball player. So you think... The fuck shit that you Kardashians do, that something isn't going to happen to your ass back in return, that you continue to do mean things to people and and steal people's stuff and lie on people and and, and be hateful that your life is going to be good because I can never figure out why Chloe can't keep a man. It's because she's a whore. I'm not trying to be mean. I'm not trying to be funny. But she's a whore just like all her sisters. And they're all fucked up individuals. Like, then people be like, damn, I want to be like them. Hell no. 
Kim Kardashian, her motherfucking self, everybody in Hollywood's fucked her. Her family made a living off of uh, her quarantine if it wasn't for Ray J. Let's be fucking real, guys. I'm not biased, but this is what the fuck she gets. And she'll never be happy, any of them, until they do right. Because there's a thing called energy. Which, what you do, what you think about comes back on you. And I don't think she really loved, I don't think Chloe really loved Tristan anyway. She wanted a baby. She's getting older. I believe she'll be 33 this year. I'm not sure. Or, or yeah, 33 this year. And she's feeling lonely. But unfortunately, Tristan, because you dated a Kardashian, your career is going to be fucked up. Your money is going to be fucked up. Don't be surprised when people you love end up dead. I'm just saying. Thank you for listening. Peace. Please subscribe and click the notification button. Peace and blessings. Thank you to my 205 subscribers. And thank you for my haters. Have a wonderful day.